Are you gonna tell me where you went? All the messages I sent with no reply It's like that You're just gonna walk into my Hello my stars, welcome to my channel Goddess of Whispers. It's your girl Karen and I'm so excited to welcome my Aqua Squad back to my channel. I do want to let you know this is a general love reading. This reading may or may not resonate with all of my stars, so take what does and leave the rest. If this reading does not resonate, please check with your sun, moon, rising, and Venus placements. Also the energies or the roles in my readings may be interchangeable, so apply yourself as you see fit. Don't forget if this reading does resonate, don't forget to click like, share, subscribe, and click the bell to get future notifications when your girl will be uploading another video all right guys so we are going to dive into the current energies that is surrounding the collective this week and dive into the reading okay so let's see what energies is surrounding the collective what's the energy here spirit calling on my ancestors and spirit guides some of rising in venus to the highest light to the pillars good what's the energy here surrounding the collective what's the energy here what's the energy here show me show me show me all right let's see what the energies is thank you thank you thank you what's the energy here what's the energy here thank you thank you thank you beautiful 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 thank you thank you thank you what are the energies beautiful beautiful all right so we got the community card we got the strategy card we have the thinking man card that is so like my aquas we are always thinking <laughs> thinking with logics all right and then we have here the magician and the mirror interesting energy clarify further what other energies is here we have all tied up interesting energies let's get one more one more spirit what's the energy here and then we have envy okay very strong energy coming through for you guys let's see what this reading is all about all right so we have the community card this is definitely a strong energy of wanting to come together with someone. Someone could be wanting to come together with you, okay, and now wants to reunite with you is the energy here. Someone could be missing on, you know, the connection that you guys have shared together is the energy, um, is what I am seeing. We also have the strategy card here as well. This card speaks of definitely refocusing, you know, your strategies and situations. So somebody here could be strategically coming up with a way to reach out to you, express how they are feeling towards you we definitely have the thinking man here so someone could be having second thoughts in the situation maybe thinking about how they can get you back is the energy that's surrounding you they could be missing you at this time okay i'm definitely seeing some type of message coming in here towards you is the energy okay i with the magician card here this is definitely about someone manifesting you back into their life is the energy i'm seeing someone being jealous Okay, is the energy that I'm seeing, especially with the envy card being here. The all tied up card is someone stuck in the past. Someone feels like they can't move on is the energy that I am seeing. Okay, guys. So someone is definitely in a headspace where they are missing the other person. I am seeing someone reaching out to you with some type of message. Okay, the thinking man card is here because this person is now thinking about you. Okay, someone's reminiscing on what they had is the energy and someone is definitely manifesting is the energy with the magician card. This speaks of, you know, manifesting your heart's desires, but also to can mean communication as well. Okay, and I definitely feel like someone is strategically coming up with a way to reach out to you and express how they feel about you. Someone is not happy that you are happy. <laughs> okay, believe it or not, guys, someone here is definitely title or this could be how you're feeling towards your person someone here is stuck on on the other person on their person okay is what i'm seeing um with the envy card someone here is highly jealous is the energy okay someone's jealous of the other person you know and they're not happy okay they're not happy that you're happy they're not happy that you guys are not together so you could be making someone jealous that you dealt with in the past but someone is definitely going to be speaking up okay and expressing how they are feeling let's see tap into these energies what are the energies is here spirit what's the energy surrounding this reading what are the energies is here surrounding this reading what are the energies that surrounding this reading? Thank you, thank you, thank you. We have self-love. Okay, so you can be taking care of yourself right now, okay? Looking beautiful, showing up and showing out, getting your hair done, you know, getting your nails done, taking beautiful pictures. Maybe you are dating somebody at this time, you know, but not showing this person the attention that they would think that you would be showing them, okay? You are taking care of you is the energy that I'm seeing here. You're working on you and focusing on you and you alone, and they are realizing it, and they're not liking that they're 
they're not getting the attention that they would normally get from you, okay? The bottom of the deck, we do have manifestation. Like I said, someone's manifesting you back into their life is the energy here. Someone is wanting or missing you is what I am seeing here, okay? And manifesting you into their heart okay is the energy that i'm seeing let's get to more, one more message what's the energy here spirit what's the energy surrounding this reading let's see what this is we have forgiveness mm, funny that shows up right so someone here could be reaching out to you and wanting some type of forgiveness here in the situation someone could be seeking forgiveness from you is the energy that i'm seeing but definitely someone is manifesting you back into their lives this person is definitely not happy that you are happy okay or happy without them is the energy that i'm seeing here in this reading okay let's go ahead and clarify these energies what else can you tell me spirit about this reading what's the energy here someone's probably in regret here is what i heard okay look at this the three of wands someone's waiting okay someone's reminiscing you back into their life okay or manifesting you i should say back into their life they're waiting for you to return to them is the energy with the six of cups energy very strong energy of reconciliation someone's looking into the past is the energy but someone's waiting okay this could be you this could be them take it as it resonates very strong energy here look at that page of cups that's love news on the horizon Okay, someone's definitely waiting for something to happen, but the other person is definitely taking the time to take care of themselves, focusing on themselves, and then someone here is manifesting, and look at that four, four swords, self-love is the energy here, taking care of you, looking beautiful, single, and enjoying your life, and someone here is just like, what? You happy without me? <laughs> I need to tap in and get you back, is the energy here, okay? Someone is coming in with an apology. That's what I'm sensing here very strongly. Someone's coming in with an apology. What's the energy here, spirit? Let's get a few more shuffles and then we'll clarify the energies. What's the energy here? Woo, child, won't he do it? Won't he do it? The lovers. We're going to keep that for sure. Damn sure. Yes, sir. The lovers card speaks of true love. Okay. Is the energy here coming together with someone? The energy is definitely about deep commitment, soulmates, kindred spirits, perfect unions. Someone that you found to be your best friend in life is the energy surrounding the two of you. You guys could be soulmates. Okay. This person is missing the hell out of you is the energy in this reading. This person is definitely contemplating coming in here towards you, but this person's trying to figure out how they can do that and look what's the first top card guys the chariot they're trying to figure out how they can come in here towards you and make this move you could have been dealing with the gemini with the lovers with the chariot you could be dealing with the cancer but the chariot card speaks of determination it speaks of action it speaks of change it speaks of overcoming obstacles and situations okay someone here is definitely determined okay figuring out a way to come in here towards you and it fell right under the chariot card um the strategy card this person is wanting a way to come in here towards you why is the thinking man here oh wow that's way too many cards okay why is the thinking man energy here spirit why is the thinking man energy here thank you thank you thank you and what do we have here the eight of wands communication won't he do it yes sir all right so this person is thinking about coming back in here and communicating with you this person wants to reach out to you and seek some type of forgiveness from you is the energy they see that you are happy without them they see you doing you okay is the energy and they're not happy about it okay um and not so much i wouldn't say like angry about it but definitely they're in their feelings about it okay they didn't think that you would be happy without them but whatever it is you're doing you're definitely showing up and showing out and showing them that you are happy with them out them look at that under the magician card we have the moon could have been dealing with the pisces here take it as it resonates this is about being in your head is the energy here this person's definitely trapped in their thoughts when it comes to you okay is the energy that i am seeing this person could even be dreaming about you but this person is manifesting you back into their lives okay this person is definitely using that energy force to draw you back in is the energy that i'm seeing but this person is going to face their fears and come in here towards you and express how they feel okay this person could have also been deceptive towards you here is the energy at the bottom of the deck we do have the ten of swords which is all about painful endings so things could have ended abruptly between you and this person maybe this person backstabbed you betrayed you you know broke your heart is the energy here you know something that 
that you had to walk away from, but they were not happy about the fact that you walked away from them. They didn't think that you would walk away from them is the energy here, okay? So this person's in their heads about it, okay? Very strongly in their heads thinking about it. Why is it all tied up card here, Spirit? Let's see what this is. We have the Eight of Cups showing up, okay? This person is definitely in their feelings, okay? We have the Eight of Cups and the Justice card turn out, okay? This person's in their feelings about this connection. I feel very strongly here. This person is definitely wanting to come in and seek some type of forgiveness from you with the Eight of Swords and the Justice card. This person wants justice in the situation or at least wants to come in and speak their truth, balance out the scales between you and them, okay? This speaks of a positive outcome in the situation is the energy, okay? This person's not happy that you walked away. This person feels like the situation was very passionate between you and them. They can't let go of this passion, okay? This fire that you brought to the relationship. They are missing you, okay? Could have been dealing with the Libra with the um, Justice card or a water sign with the Eight of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Clarify further what's the energy here behind the Envy card. Let's see what this is. The Nine of Swords. Didn't I say that? They're not happy. <laughs> they are super jealous and up in their feelings, okay? Yes, this is definitely an energy about thinking about the other person, okay? The Nine of Swords energy is someone who is having nightmares or anxiety. Grief is the energy. Going through some type of energy where you are feeling alone, okay? You are hopeful that you guys will get together again. And that is the energy that is surrounding this person. This person's not happy that you are happy without them is the energy that I'm seeing in this reading. All right, let's clarify further some more energies. We're going to clarify the energies here, okay? At the bottom of the deck, we have the Seven of Pentacles and then we have the Nine of Wands at the bottom of the deck. So very strong strong energy here this person could feel like you are very defensive towards them but this person's manifesting you i'm telling you they're manifesting you to come back to them as the energy but this person may be feeling like you won't give them the day the time of day they find you to be very cold and distant is the energy here definitely your energy with the king of swords someone here is being in a space where they are head over heart not giving the person the time of day they don't think that you would speak to them is the energy or that you will hear what they have to say okay or be open to the fact that of what they have to say that i can't even speak guys <laughs> okay my mind is going ten thousand miles per hour we have here the three of swords showing up as well so definitely speaks of being broken hearted so someone was broken hearted by the situation because of what happened there's heartbreak here grief you know so definitely a strong energy of someone just going through the flow or was going through the flow which caused them to be very detached from the other person okay so i feel like this person wants to come in here towards you guys but it's definitely surrounding an energy where they just don't know where to start or what to say this person could have broken your heart and know that they did but this person is coming in with an energy that they love you now and they're not happy they're jealous of whatever it is that you're doing okay it could be you know taking care of yourself more looking good you know is the energy here but this person is wanting you back clarify the energy surrounding this reading clarify the lovers the chariot the eight of wands the moon the justice and the eight of cups and the nine of swords energy why is these energies here let's see what this is all right so we have the strength card clarifying the lovers this person is building the courage to come in here towards you is the energy okay um it's very strongly here you could have been dealing with the leo take it as it resonates but this person is wanting a new beginning this person is remembering when you guys were most happy this person is thinking of reconciliation okay is the energy clarify the chariot why is the chariot here spirit why is the chariot here why is the chariot here spirit clarify the chariot what's the energy behind the chariot all right let's see what this is we have the wheel of fortune okay that speaks of change of heart things changing a turning point in the situation this person is strategically thinking of how they want to come in here towards you because they realize you make them happy. This person's having an epiphany, okay? It's the energy that I'm seeing here, guys. This person is wanting to reach out to you, and they will. It's going to be in the form of a message is the energy here, okay? Clarify the Eight of Wands. Why is the Eight of Wands here? Clarify the Eight of Wands energy. Why is the Eight of Wands here? Why is the Eight of Wands here? Thank you, thank you, thank you. We have the King of Wands. This person is thinking about you. Could have been dealing with an Aries, okay? An Aries, Leo, or a Sagittarius, okay? This person's in their heads and it's fell over the thinking man with the Eight of Wands. This person is strategically finding a way to come in here towards you is the energy, okay? Can't make this shit up, guys. I'm telling you, this is a very strong energy. Someone is now in their feelings over the situation and now wants to come in here towards you and build the strength 
strength and courage to do so. But this is very a very strong energy of someone who is taking action in a situation. They will take action towards you, okay? Clarify the moon card. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Won't he do it? Won't he do it? This person is not happy, okay? This person's feeling like you don't love them anymore. And guess what? Because they are now in their feelings that you don't love them anymore or that they're losing you or that you're slipping away, they want to come back in here now and offer you some type of proposal. They want an apology. They want to apologize. They want to come in here and manifest you back into their lives. They are hoping that you will take them back is the energy that I'm seeing here. They're not happy without you. Okay. So they're going to come in here. They're seeing that you're very detached towards them and they're not liking it at all clarify the justice card in the eight of cups clarify the justice card in the eight of cups clarify the justice card in the eight of cups spirit what's the energy behind the justice card in the eight of cups what's the energy here okay so we have the nine of cups showing up and showing out for the justice card in the eight of cups and then we also have the ten of wands i feel very strongly here this person stressing over the situation is the energy um i do feel like the connection between you and them it was very stressful at one point could have been a lot going on between you and them but i feel like this person is carrying this weight on their shoulders as far as how they truly feel about you they could have been hiding their emotions towards you this whole time but this person is definitely releasing it now they need to release that energy and now come in towards you and express how they feel with the nine of cups this is definitely an energy someone looking at you as a wish come true here so they need to release that burden of hiding how they truly feel or masking how they truly feel because at the bottom of the deck guys we got the king of swords that's definitely an energy of someone who's detached cold as ice not expecting expressing how they feel towards you. This is a head over heart type of energy. So this person is carrying this burden when really and truly, in fact, they truly do care about you. So I feel like this person's coming in now to express that towards you. They're not happy that you are doing you is the energy. Clarify the nine of swords. Why is the nine of swords here? Clarify the energy behind the nine of swords. What's the energy behind the nine of swords here? What's the energy here? Thank you, thank you, thank you. We have the six of pentacles. They want to come in and give to the relationship equally. <laughs> <laughs> okay guys yes that is the energy they want to now come back with a pity pity patty story and come and give to the relationship equally we have the three of wands showing up and showing out we got the empress card showing up and showing out and then we have the eight of wands and then right after that guys is the four of pentacles this person wants to come back in and own you okay this person sees you as someone that you they belong to you okay is the energy that i'm seeing okay or you belong to them is what i meant to say okay but with the three of wands the empress the eight of wands and the four of pentacles this person feels like they have to protect what's theirs okay so they feel like they're losing you so now they're coming in here towards you to express this energy they were waiting for you it's almost like they always knew you would come back to them as the energy here or at least they would have a second chance with you this person sees you as someone who is very nurturing they see you as someone who's very beautiful they see you as someone of abundance here with the empress card they're seeing your growth from a distance and they're seeing you growing without them they seeing you doing bad all by your damn self without them okay and they're not happy about that whatever that may mean for you guys we got the eight of wands showing up here twice in the reading that speaks of communication with the king of wands energy that speaks of action honey so this person is coming in here to make some type of action towards you but they're strategically coming up with a way on how they're going to do that because they know they did you wrong okay they know they did you wrong and for some of you we have the king of swords showing up in the reading twice so very strong energy of someone here definitely blocked the other person or ghosted the other person definitely came became very detached from the situation but i feel like now the shoe is on the other foot okay so now this person's seeing okay well they're not reaching out to me anymore they're not contacting me anymore they're not trying to get me back anymore so this is now a change of heart this person's now in their feelings and now wanting to come in here towards you because you are focusing on self self-love here we have the manifestation card and now they want to they want to manifest you back into their life and now they want to seek some type of forgiveness from you is the energy here okay let's get a few more cards and a few more energies and see what's going on here i want to know how this person is truly feeling about you clarify the energy surrounding this reading spirit how is my aquarius this person truly feeling how is my aquarius this person truly feeling with the energy here Clarify further. What's the energy here? How is my Aquarius this person truly feeling? Thank you, thank you, thank you. Wow, we got a lot of energies coming through. Let's try that again. Let's try that again. What's the energy here? How is my Aquarius this person truly feeling? What's the energy here, Spirit? 
Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, so we have, it says engagement. I can't see my life without you. I am ready to commit. So this person could have been non-committal at one point in the relationship. So definitely now seeing you in a different light, this person probably wants to come back in now and offer you some type of commitment. We also have here conflict. The fighting and arguments became too much. So definitely an energy, this person's feeling like things became too heightened here between you and them. There could have been a lot of energies as far as arguing goes. Didn't I say that? But I feel like this person's definitely could have been the cause of a lot of the arguments okay so take it as it resonates but i definitely feel very strongly here this person seek now wanting to come in and seek a new beginning we have at the bottom of the deck manifest someone is manifesting their heart's desires okay this person definitely is seeking a new beginning with you and hopefully hoping that you will take them back all right what other energies is here spirit what other energies is here in the reading what other energies is here let's see what this is it says priceless i traded your love for someone i thought was more valuable but as time passed i am realizing you are priceless priceless okay so this person could have ghosted you for someone else okay been in a relationship with someone else but they're seeing you from afar doing big and bold being um, big and bad all by yourself is the energy here so this person is now wanting to come back in towards you because they are seeing you happy without them they're seeing you as their empress we also have here wish i wish things were different between us okay so this person is now all up in their feelings because guess what guys they want to reconcile didn't I say that? This person wants to come in and reconcile with you is the energy. This person says, I want you back and I miss you. Okay. So that's going to be completely up to you. All right. If you decide to take this person back or not is the energy surrounding this reading. Let's get a few more cards with the romance angels. What's the energy surrounding this reading spirit? What's the energy surrounding this reading? What's the energy here? What's the energy surrounding this reading? What's the energy surrounding this reading for my Aquariuses? What's the energy here, Spirit? What's the energy here surrounding the reading? Thank you, thank you, thank you. We have children. It says your love life is being affected by children. So for some of you, okay, you could have children with this person. This is for some of you, not all of you. So this could also be a reason. Maybe this person's missing their family and now wants to come home, okay, is the energy. What other energies are surrounding this reading? What other energies? Thank you, thank you, thank you. We have here unrequited love. There's not enough attraction or chemistry to keep this relationship going. So this person is feeling like very strongly here that you don't love them anymore okay is the energy here they feel like they're losing you is the energy that's coming through in this reading they feel like you will not give them a second chance and this is now making them more so want to come in here towards you what other energies is here spirit thank you oh wow that's a lot all right what other energies is here spirit one more card what's the energy here what's the energy here for this reading clarify further what's the energy here one card please what's the energy what's the energy surrounding this reading Thank you, thank you, thank you. We have worth waiting for. Divine timing is at work in your love life, okay? So things are happening behind the scenes here, okay? I feel like someone's waiting on the other person. Didn't I say that with the three of wands showing up here twice in the reading? Someone's waiting on the other person. This person's now feeling like you're worth waiting for. And that's a lot of cards that wanted to flip. Let's get one more energy to close out from this deck. What's the energy here? Thank you, thank you, thank you. It says, stay optimistic about your love life. Positive thinking and fate will bring you romance. I feel very strongly here this person is highly manifesting you back into their lives they're now wishing that you would come back to them and give them a second chance here is the energy okay let's get um one card or two from this deck and then we'll close out with some advice from spirit what's the energy surrounding this reading what's the energy surrounding this reading for my aquariuses what's the energy surrounding this reading for my aquariuses what is it that they need to know What's the energy here? What's the energy here surrounding this reading? Okay, so we have we have healing. Okay, and then we have answers. Let's get one more card and then we'll dive into the energy. The explanation of the energy. Plus I further spirit. What other energies is here? One more. What's the energy here? Thank you. Thank you. Oh, wow. That's a lot. All right. So we have peace and then we have forgiveness showing up and showing out again. All right. So very strong energy here, guys. This is definitely speaking of someone is now accepting the situation for what it is and finally healed from the situation and moving on. I sense that here very strongly. I feel very strongly here. Someone, I feel this is you, my Aquariuses. You know, now you're in an energy where you're like, you know what? I don't even need this anymore. I don't need the bullshit in my life. I'm ready to move on. So maybe at one point you were 
open to working it out, but I feel like this person feels you pulling away from them, okay, because you are now healing from all the bullshit that they put you through is the energy here, and I feel like that's why this person's wanting to come in here towards you. We have answers, okay? This is about speaking your truth, okay, or someone here could be seeking some type of knowledge in a situation. I feel very strongly here the answers that you seek is coming to you now because I feel like now this person is going to come and be an open book with you because they are wanting a second beginning with you is the energy, okay? Um, we have here peace. This is about inner peace, okay? Order being restored to a situation. Very strongly here, I feel like this person is now wanting to come in and bring peace to the relationship, okay? This person is now wanting to come in and commit to you is the energy that I'm seeing. But I'm also seeing this is here because of inner peace within yourself. You have decided to accept things for what it is and move on with your life. And this person is feeling that energy being pulled away from them. You took your power back and they are feeling it. So now they're here they come all right here they come in wanting on their horse their knight in shining armor horse coming in with their apology they are seeking forgiveness okay don't we have that here they are seeking forgiveness from you okay this person wants to come in now and apologize okay this person wants to now bring peace of mind to the situation but more so on their end a peace of mind because they can't get you out of their heads now okay they're seeing you moving on with your life and they're seeing you very happy you are focused on self and and you are focused on self-love, okay, is the energy that's surrounding you. Let's go ahead and close out with some advice from Spirit. What's the advice here, Spirit, for my Aquariuses? What's the advice here, Spirit, for my, Aquari for my Aquariuses? What's the energy here? What's the energy surrounding this reading? What's the energy here surrounding this reading? What's the energy here surrounding this reading? What's the energy here? Thank you, thank you, thank you. We have your dreams need a practical plan. Full moon in Taurus. Feel very strongly, huh, guys. Like I said, this person is strategically coming up with a way on how they can get you back. Okay? I feel very strongly here this person's going to come in, but they're going to figure out some type of way or some type of sob story as to, you know, why things happen the way that they happen because this person's going to come in and express how they feel towards you. We have expect powerful change. New moon in eclipse is the energy that fell out here on the top card. Okay? I feel very strongly here something is happening here behind the scenes and this person is going to come in and tell you how they've changed and how they want things to be better between you and them let's get one more card for the close out what's the energy here spirit one more card what's the energy here thank you thank you thank you we have the end of a tough cycle approaches full moon in capricorn very strongly here guys this is definitely someone going through something as well but definitely a situation where um, that cycle is going to close out and a new cycle is going to begin here for you. But I do see reconciliation here and that's if you guys want to reconcile with this person. I do feel like this person is going to reach out, out to you in the form of a message is the energy that I'm seeing and telling you some type of story as to why things happened the way that they did and how they wish you and them could be a thing again is the energy. Okay, This person is manifesting you back into their life and they're hoping that they can come in and seek some type of forgiveness from you. OK, because they are jealous right now of how your life is going and how theirs is going is the energy. They think of you as someone that uh, like a soulmate is the energy here with the lover's card showing up here. OK, but they're building the courage. They're building the courage to come in towards you. OK. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed your reading till next time. Bye. I guess you're back. Are you going to tell me where you went? All the messages I sent with no reply.